order to keep your Cytoflex working properly, it is important to perform the routine maintenance recommended by Beckman Coulter. Please make sure your cytometer is turned off and unplugged from any electrical outlet. Once every six months, Beckman Coulter recommends that you replace the deep clean solution. In order to access the deep clean bottle, you must first remove the right side panel. Open the top cover of the Cytoflex flow cytometer and loosen the capture thumb screws at the top. Remove the deep clean bottle and fill with a one-to-one -one mixture of Beckman Coulter Contrad 70 and deionized water. Please refer to the IFU for more detailed instructions. Replace the newly filled bottle. This completes the deep clean procedure. Beckman Coulter recommends that you change the sheath filter once every six months. In order to remove the sheath filter, simply disconnect the quick connector located at the top of the filter area. Gently pull out the filter and disconnect the other end of the quick connector. Replace the new sheath filter by reconnecting the quick connectors located at both the top and bottom of the sheath filter area. Please refer to your IFU for detailed instructions on how to bleed the air out of the new sheath filter. This ends the sheath filter replacement procedure. Beckman Coulter recommends that you change the sample line once every six months. To remove the old sample tubing, first remove the thumb screws that hold the sample peristaltic pump cover. To replace the sample tubing, simply remove the tubing by pulling the stoppers and the tubing out of the peristaltic pump and disconnect the sample line. Remove the sample probe from the sample probe station. To install the new sample tubing, place the new sample probe in the sample probe station. Reinsert the sample line into the line from the flow cell. Fit the new sample tubing into the peristaltic pump by inserting both stoppers and running the tubing into the peristaltic pump. And replace the cover by tightening the thumb screw. Please refer to the IFU for detailed instructions. Once you have completed the maintenance procedures, reattach the right side of the panel and close the top cover of the Cytoflex flow cytometer. This ends the Cytoflex maintenance procedures.